Tip number 11. Don't forget to place mounting holes on your board. And uh, I mean the mounting holes which are used to fix your board inside an enclosure or which are used to mount your board somewhere uh, into a system. It may look like this is not an important tip because uh, you may think people place mounting holes on the PCBs automatically. They don't. Okay, I've seen many boards with no mounting holes. Maybe some of the boards they are designed intentionally with no mounting holes, but I'm pretty sure it may happen that you may forget about placing mounting holes on the board. I'm pretty sure because it happened to me <laughs> long time ago. I completely forgot about this. Okay, I focused on the schematic, I focused on the PCB, and I was not thinking ahead enough. I was not thinking how the customers, how the people who buy the board, how they are going to use it. So always when you are designing a board, imagine that someone uh, bought the board, they have it on their table, and uh, what now? What they are going to do with your board? Are they going to keep it on their table? Or are they going to place it uh, inside their product? I, are they going to build enclosure around your board? Or uh, they are going to mount it somewhere? Don't forget, think ahead. Yeah, imagine how your board is going to be used. That's why this uh, tip is important. So the tip number 11, don't forget to place mounting holes on your board. Why? If there are no mounting holes, how you are going to fit or how your customers are going to fit it into enclosure or a system.